The White House National Security Council (NSC) is the principal forum used by the President of the United States for consideration of national security, military matters, and foreign policy matters with senior national security advisors and cabinet officials and is part of the executive office of the President of the United States. Since its inception under Harry S. Truman, the function of the Council has been to advise and assist the President on national security and foreign policies. The Council also serves as the President's principal arm for coordinating these policies among various government agencies. The Council has counterparts in the National Security Councils of many other nations. History The predecessor to the National Security Council was the National Intelligence Authority which was established by President Harry S. Truman's executive letter of the 22nd of January 1946 to oversee the Central Intelligence Group, the CIA's predecessor. The NIA was composed of the Secretary of State, Secretary of War, Secretary of the Navy, and the Chief of Staff to the Commander-in-Chief. The National Security Council was created in 1947 by the National Security Act. It was created because policymakers felt that the diplomacy of the State Department was no longer adequate to contain the USSR in light of the tension between the Soviet Union and the United States. The intent was to ensure coordination and concurrence among the Army, Marine Corps, Navy, Air Force and other instruments of national security policy such as the Central Intelligence Agency CIA, also created in the National Security Act. In 2004, the position of Director of National Intelligence DNI was created, taking over the responsibilities previously held by the head of CIA, the Director of Central Intelligence, as a cabinet-level position to oversee and coordinate activities of the intelligence community. On May 26, 2009, President Barack Obama merged the White House staff supporting the Homeland Security Council HSC and the National Security Council into one National Security Staff NSS. The HSC and NSC each continue to exist by statute as bodies supporting the president. The name of the staff organization was changed back to National Security Council staff in 2014. On January 29, 2017, President Donald Trump restructured the Principals Committee, a subset of the full National Security Council, while at the same time altering the attendance of the Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff and Director of National Intelligence. On April 5, 2017, President Trump removed Steve Bannon from the Security Council. According to a National Security Presidential Memorandum 2, the Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff and Director of National Intelligence were to sit on the Principals Committee as and when matters pertaining to them arise, but will remain part of the full National Security Council. However, Chief of Staff Reince Priebus clarified the next day that they still are invited to attend meetings. With National Security Presidential Memorandum 4 in April 2017, the Director of National Intelligence and the Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff shall attend Principals Committee meetings and included the Director of the Central Intelligence Agency as a regular attendee. The reorganization also placed the Administrator of the United States Agency for International Development as a permanent member of the Deputies Committee, winning moderate praise. As of 6 April 2017, the White House Chief Strategist has been removed from the National Security Council and the roles of the Director of National Intelligence, CIA Director and Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff have been restored to the Principals Committee. Detailed history For a detailed history of the United States National Security Council by year C. Authority and powers The National Security Council was established by the National Security Act of 1947, Place 235-61 Stat. 496, USC 402, amended by the National Security Act Amendments of 1949, 63 Stat. 579, 50 USC 401 at SEQ. Later in 1949, as part of the reorganization plan, the council was placed in the executive office of the president. The High Value Detainee Interrogation Group also reports to the NSC. Topic: Kill authorizations. 
A secret National Security Council panel pursues the killing of an individual, including American citizens, who has been called a suspected terrorist. In this case, no public record of this decision or any operation to kill the suspect will be made available. The panel's actions are justified by two principal legal theories. They were permitted by Congress when it authorized the use of military forces against militants in the wake of the attacks of September 11, 2001, and they are permitted under international law if a country is defending itself." Homeland Security Advisor John O. Brennan, who has helped codify targeted killing criteria by creating the Disposition Matrix database, has described the Obama administration targeted killing policy by stating that in order to ensure that our counterterrorism operations involving the use of lethal force are legal, ethical, and wise, President Obama has demanded that we hold ourselves to the highest possible standards and processes." Reuters has reported that Anwar al Awlaki, an American citizen, was on such a kill list and was killed accordingly. On February 4, 2013, NBC published a leaked Department of Justice memo providing a summary of the rationale used to justify targeted killing of U.S. citizens who are senior operational leaders of al Qaeda or associated forces. Membership <inaudible> 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 The Trump administration's National Security Council, as per the statute and National Security Presidential Memorandum 4, is chaired by the President. Its members are the Vice President statutory, the Secretary of State statutory, the Secretary of Defense statutory, the Secretary of Energy statutory, the National Security Advisor non-statutory, the Attorney General non-statutory, the Secretary of Homeland Security non-statutory, the Representative of the United States to the United Nations non-statutory, and the Secretary of the Treasury non-statutory, the Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff as the statutory military advisor to the Council. The Director of National Intelligence is the Statutory Intelligence Advisor, and the Director of National Drug Control Policy is the Statutory Drug Control Policy Advisor. The Chief of Staff to the President, White House Counsel, and the Assistant to the President for Economic Policy are also regularly invited to attend NSC meetings. The Attorney General, the Director of the Office of Management and Budget and the Director of the Central Intelligence Agency are invited to attend meetings pertaining to their responsibilities. The heads of other executive departments and agencies, as well as other senior officials, are invited to attend meetings of the NSC when appropriate. Topic: Principles Committee. The Principles Committee of the National Security Council is the cabinet-level senior interagency forum consideration of national security policy issues. The Principals Committee is convened and chaired by the National Security Advisor. The regular attendees of the Principals Committee are the Secretary of State, the Secretary of the Treasury, the Secretary of Defense, the Attorney General, the Secretary of Energy, the Secretary of Homeland Security, the White House Chief of Staff, the Director of National Intelligence, the Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, the Director of the Central Intelligence Agency, the Homeland Security Advisor, and the United States Ambassador to the United Nations, the White House Counsel, the Deputy Counsel to the President for National Security Affairs, the Director Director of the Office of Management and Budget, the Deputy National Security Advisor, the Deputy National Security Advisor for Strategy, the National Security Advisor to the Vice President, and the NSC Executive Secretary may also attend all meetings of the Principals Committee. When considering international economic issues, the Principals Committee's regular attendees will include the Secretary of Commerce, the United States Trade Representative, and the Assistant to the President for Economic Policy. Topic. Deputies Committee The National Security Council Deputies Committee is the senior sub-cabinet interagency forum for consideration of national security policy issues. The Deputies Committee is also responsible for reviewing and monitoring the interagency national security process including for establishing and directing the policy coordination committees. 
The Deputies Committee is convened and chaired by the Deputy National Security Advisor or the Deputy Homeland Security Advisor. Regular members of the Deputies Committee are the Deputy National Security Advisor for Strategy, the Deputy Secretary of State, Deputy Secretary of the Treasury, the Deputy Secretary of Defense, the Deputy Attorney General, the Deputy Secretary of Energy, the Deputy Secretary of Homeland Security, the Deputy Director of the Office of Management and Budget, the Deputy Director of National Intelligence, the Vice Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, the National Security Advisor to the Vice President, the Administrator of the United States Agency for International Development, and the Deputy Director of the Central Intelligence Agency. Invitations to participate in or attend specific meetings are extended to Deputy or Under Secretary level of executive departments and agencies and to other senior officials when relevant issues are discussed. The Executive Secretary and the Deputy White House Counsel also attend. The relevant senior director on the National Security Council staff is also invited to attend when relevant. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Policy Coordination Committees. The Policy Coordination Committees of the National Security Council, established and directed by the Deputies Committee, are responsible for the management of the development and implementation of national security policies through interagency coordination. Policy Coordination Committees are the main day-to-day -day fora for interagency coordination of national security policy development, implementation and analysis in aid of the Deputies Committee and the Principals Committee. Policy coordination committees are chaired by senior directors on the National Security Council staff, or sometimes National Economic Council staff, with assistant secretary level officials from the relevant executive department or agency acting as co-chairs. See also